Today, I'll be sharing with you seven useful shortcuts in Unity. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Hi everyone, this is Omar Bafaki, and welcome to this video where I'm going to share with you seven useful shortcuts to boost your performance and creation in the editor. And before we start, I just want to thank you guys for reaching 3,000 subscribers. 3,000? That's crazy. So, thank you so much to every single one of you. And I've got this message for you. I love you 3,000. And now, let's get started. To use any of these tools, you can use the QWERTY keys starting from Q all the way to the Y key. Second shortcut, if you want to create an empty game object, Press Ctrl Shift N or Command Shift N on Mac, and a new game object will be created. Third shortcut Let's say you want that game object to be a child. Instead of dragging it to make it a child, you can select an object, then press Alt Shift N to create an empty game object as a child of the selected object. And the fourth shortcut is activating and deactivating game objects. Usually, you check and uncheck the active state box. You can do that by pressing Alt-Shift-A to toggle the active state. Shortcut number 5. To add a component, you can press Ctrl-Shift-A or Command-Shift-A on Mac and the Add Component menu will pop up. Then type the component you want. And shortcut number 6 is duplicating objects. To do so, simply hit Ctrl-D or Command-D on Mac and a new instance will be created. And that brings us to the seventh and last shortcut. Moving the cube is smooth. Let's say you want to move it according to the grid. To snap it, simply hold down the control key or command key on Mac while moving the object. And that's it for today's video. I hope you found it useful. Let me know in the comments what's your favorite shortcuts. If you'd like to see more of these Unity tutorials, make sure to subscribe and remember to hit the bell icon to get notified whenever a new video is uploaded. This is Omar Bafaki. Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Bye bye.